coordinator of an organization called Sustainable Portland. But I'm here tonight as a Homer resident, um, very concerned about this issue. Uh, I had a really long day today, a um, very exciting day though. I was at Homer Elementary School organizing a farm to school event with the elementary school children where they got to learn about uh, the importance of protecting the environment uh, and supporting agri local agriculture. And they were able to shop at a little farmer's market that we set up for them um, through some co community donations. And this evening, I was also involved in a group that organized a discussion on climate change on campus at SUNY Cortland with students. We had about 150 students really engaged and concerned about this issue. And we had a panel of experts from around central New York uh, there to address some of the concerns that students had. So it was a really positive day um, with a lot of discussion around issues facing uh, our communities. And now I'm here this evening and I appreciate that we've had these, these discussions for so long, but I also feel very frustrated. Um, I think our board, I think the elders of our community you guys are very intelligent and very knowledgeable. You've had so many years of experience. And, and I ask you to trust in your experience. I think you can make this decision for us. And I don't think we should be trusting the DAC. Um, I think we need to take the precautionary measure here and pass this moratorium and move forward with that process and pass a ban. Because there's too much that doesn't feel right. And there's too much, too many constituents of Homer that don't feel it's right. And I feel like we've, you know, gone with economic gain over protecting the common good and the environment for too long. It's time to have a big picture. And hydrofracking is just not right right now. Uh, the industry has not proven itself, and it has not been studied enough. It's as simple as that. It really is to me. And I really ask that the elders of our community listen to everyone and really uh, make a decision that's good for generations to come. And I'm very concerned as a young adult who wants to, you know, build roots in this community. Um, I really appreciate uh, the input and the experience of the older generations, but I really ask that, uh, that we look down the road. And I, and I think you are. Uh, but there's just, there's too many concerns. There really is, and there's not even enough study. So I think we, as Homer, need to make a decision, and can make a decision, and waiting for the DC is, is 